Welcome everybody once again to this year's PolyFintech 100 API Hackathon Grand Finals. Well, today we have uh, guests on site. We also have a lot more guests joining us online uh, via the live stream as well. It is my pleasure to speak to all of you at the fourth PolyFintech 100 API Hackathon. The fintech industry is a promising sector with potential for high growth. It's also an exciting space to be in, filled with many opportunities to innovate and collaborate. I hope this hackathon has given you a fun and memorable experience to consider charting your future in the promising fintech sector. I wish the five grand finalists all the very best for the competition today. Besides providing creative solutions, this hackathon, the fourth in the series, helps to build the fintech talent pool a much-needed resource to support the digitization of the financial industry in Singapore. It is indeed heartening to see the collaborative partnership between the industry and the educational institution bearing fruit as our poly students form an important pipeline to the fintech talent development for Singapore to be a smart financial centre. Uh, this allowed me to gain more valuable insights from my teammates. I think I would encourage anyone to join the hackathon because I think initially our team, we were very hesitant to join because we didn't think we would win. But you know, you never know and we have come this far. So I think it's really, it goes to show that anyone can really do it. So we give them the insurance background and they come in with the tech expertise and the knowledge of what Gen Z's want. And we found it to be a very productive collaboration. Uh, we're also really inspired by their energy and enthusiasm and we look forward to working with them as well as future teams in the Poly Fintech 100 context. We gain a lot of uh, exposure in terms of the fintech industry itself. We need to be creative, improve ourselves and get advice from mentors, our super, uh, sponsors and maybe our supervisor. It can be stressful but it can be fun as well. I believe their solution can get a revolution in Singapore's hawker culture. If I was a student, this opportunity would have come up it would have been a great opportunity because in this opportunity, they got to solve a social problem. They got to build a business use case around it. So it's definitely a win-win for us as well. Most of us actually come from cybersecurity. So fintech and financial sector is not really part of what we learn in school. So through this, we actually learn a lot of insights through financial sector and fintech, as well as for our category decentralized finance. Like, like we, we, we technically do it as a team. When, whenever we meet up, uh, either virtually or physically. It's really a very good experience. This is the kind of experience and then I would say opportunity, something you cannot find from textbook. Or even if let's say for someone to just uh, you know graduate, work in a company, they will never get that kind of experience as well. So I think that is the biggest opportunity and biggest, uh, I think, take away from all these uh, you know students in this program. Just take a step forward and try out for the hackathon, no matter how inexperienced you are. We mentioned that we don't have any experience with both finance or programming. Yeah, so we'll just try it out and see who knows, you know, your idea might go all the way. I was quite impressed by the students that they can really bring the innovative ideas along the journey. It's also a great pleasure for me to work together with them uh, to further make the ideas to be more realistic to the reality. The experience of working with people from different backgrounds and different courses. This is something that I didn't really experience back when I was in secondary school and during my other poly projects. Because of the stiff competition, uh, we have seen many great teams with really good ideas. During the middle of our grand finals and also grand finals, we all we felt like we want to give up. But um, we were really get, glad that our idea was the winning idea. And it really teach me to, 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 to not give up until the last moment. I think they brought a lot of creative thinking to the solutions and to the whole exercise. Innovative, uh, groundbreaking kind of thinking. They are able to have good mentors okay, from the companies. Uh, they are providing advice to them. The second benefit I will see is really the interaction among the students. While we say it is a competition, uh, but I'm sure that they are also learning involved in this whole event. Very, very impressed with the quality of presentations that I saw earlier and also looking forward to some of them succeeding as proper businesses. Great work there by the PolyFintech 100 in organizing this. Great work by the mentors in actually taking these students through this whole process. And I'm sure it has been a rewarding and learning experience, not just for the students, but also for the community who has been involved.